All right, so what do you do if you're trying to reconcile a shipment and you can't find the shipment that you're trying to associate it with? So you've got an FBA shipment, all these FBA shipments have come in and you're trying to reconcile it to one of your purchase orders. But the purchase order and the shipment in the purchase order is not showing up. So let's look at an example of that. So say we're trying to reconcile this one, right? This is the uh, FBA shipment number. And then we say, okay, it's coming from our supplier. It's coming from Cell Accessories Limited. Now are all the units uh, to FBA listed above going to Amazon immediately? We'll say yes. Is there an or order already created in the SO stock? Yes. And then you pull it up and you only have this order here, this 250 units. You say, well, that was an air shipment. Um, this was not connected. So that's 250 units. I have 1,200 units here. Where's my other shipment uh, from this order? So we'll go over here and we say we have, here's this first shipment, right? Shipment number one, 250 units. All right, you scroll down, you see that there is another shipment of 5,000 units. That's the one that you wanna associate it with. So why is it not showing up here? Now the reason that it's not showing up here is because uh, you may have a problem in your lead time. This lead time here is saying that it's going to a warehouse. It's not going to Amazon. So all you have to do is actually just change the lead time. So you say, okay, I made a mistake. I'm not sending this to a warehouse. I'm actually sending this directly to FBA. And I'm gonna confirm that. Now it's going to FBA. We have to remember to change the marketplace and assign the marketplace. It's going to the US, right? If you don't put the right marketplace, you also might not be seeing um, it to be able to associate it properly. So put the marketplace that it's going to, and then you do save. Right, and now it's active, okay, just for good measure. And then we're gonna go back here. Let's refresh this page. And go back here and go through the same little steps again. Yes, and all of a sudden there is your shipment number two and you can go ahead and click confirm and it'll deduct this amount from your 5,000 units and that will be all reconciled. And then you're all good to go.